When I was a kid, we used to play this game called Simon Says. All right, most of us have played that, unless you're really young, because there's no app for it. it, it Simon Says is, uh, you know, you just, Simon Says, pat your head, you know, so, okay, you know, Simon said it. Um, it's just, it was a very simple game, but it's so weird how in the church, Jesus Says is a totally different game. If Jesus says something, you don't have to do it, you just have to memorize it. You, 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 you study it, you memorize You guys, it, it doesn't make any sense. A lot of the things we do, when he tells us to go out and make disciples, and how many people in the, our churches are actually making disciples? But they memorized it. You know, when I tell my daughter, hey, hey, Rach, go clean your room. She doesn't come back to me two hours later and go, I memorized what you said. <laughs> you said, Rach, go clean your room. I can say it in Greek. <laughs> my friends are going to come over and we're going to have a study on what it would look like if I cleaned my room. <laughs> she knows better than that. And so why do we think we're going to come before the judge one day and quote everything that he said and talk about how much we know. It's just, it's just this black and white stuff. If I just started with scripture, I'd go, here's what I would do. I would start making disciples. 